Hey guys, welcome back to Advanced Wars! And who is this guy exactly? Blow ye winds o' oh, the morning, blow ye winds high o! Oh. Drake! What are you doing all the way out here? You've got to get into position! Morning, Eagle! <laughs> Wouldn't you rather to sit back in the sun a while? Are you insane? Orange Star Army is on the move. Oh, is that so? Is that so? Drake, are you? Ha, <laughs> be cool. Everything's under control. No need to rush. <laughs> I got everything set up. Oh, wow, didn't the sun feel good? Oh, uh, he's gone. Oh, well, I guess I better get underway before Eagle gets his feathers any more ruffled. Drake will always find some way to sidetrack me. He's absolutely peerless in naval combat. Sometimes I wonder. Alright. Another divergence where we can choose three diff uh, of the three people. We will go into different maps. Uh, um, Drake is, like he said, peerless in naval combat. He is utterly ridiculous. His co-power is something annoying as well. That's why I'm going to pick Andy for this one. Alright, is Captain Drake. Oh, Andy, can you hear me? Is that you now? What's up? We have an emergency. The Coral Fortress is being stormed by Drake of Green Earth. But... We've never had trouble with him before, so we didn't see them coming. There are a bunch of bad guys here. The point of vital import. This is a point of vital importance to Orange Star. If the enemy seizes a lot of properties here, we'll lose control of the area. You have to beat them to it and secure as many cities as possible, including your base and HQ. You must secure 12 properties to win. Secure as many properties as possible. Okay, I got it. These bases are yours to use. Hey, deplore whatever you you, you you see fit. I'm counting on you. I've got it covered. Um, hey, uh, which units do we use to capture again? Oh, Andy. Silly. Yes, this is going to be one heck of a fight. It's a pretty short, uh, well, short, not short, but small map. But Drake is nothing to be, not one to be snuffed at. You want to get rid of his naval units as soon as you can. Submarines are something fierce as well. Alright, we are going to put a tank in there. You're going to have our medium tank come down. Because there, while there is a distance between these two places, this me medium place is some... at medium. This middle place is something that's really fought over. Uh, partially because it has four spaces for things to be captured, but you just want to make sure you stay out of this range and this range. He has no cruiser, so we're okay in that department, but still, um, we don't want him sinking our lander. It's not impossible without a lander, but it's going to be darn hard. Alright, <laughs> now's the time. I need to know if Orange Star Army was behind those black hearted attacks. Well, black hearted acts. Anchors away! Yep, something happened that Eagle says Andy did and he didn't, so we're. You don't really figure out what exactly goes on until later in the story. Oh, he's moving over there. Uh, by the way, what kind of co is Drake? I've heard he's virtually unstoppable in naval combat. His armada is supposed to be a real powerhouse. There you go again, Sammy. <laughs> You're a warehouse of intel. But I could swear there was something else. Something big. What could she ever mean about that? Huh. Yes. So you can attack him from here, but you only do 44%, and that's probably not what you want to do. 
uh, at all. All right, you want to do th one of these numbers right here. Put the tank on a city. Put the infantry nearby. All right, we want to do one of these. So yeah, he'll he's probably gonna do that. Nah. All right, we're gonna start capturing. I probably should have done that turn one. I didn't. Ah. All right. Okay, I knew he was gonna get that one. Okay, so he comes in from that direction, fires away, brings it down to three. Okay, he runs in surfaces. Okay, he ran into my sub. Good. That's what I wanted. Alright, I'm going to fire away at this sub right here. We don't need him taking off with N subs. That's the last thing we need. Um, Uh, we can actually just do this kind of fire away here. All right. Um, it doesn't really matter if your infantry here gets hit. Uh, you just want to make sure you get rid of this one infantry so it doesn't capture all of those little spaces in the middle little cities and we want to move our lander here because it's very important uh, retreat him have this guy move back and fire okay mm. ah moved it back one too many all right. Finish capturing that. Uh, I'll end my turn. Okay, it's probably gonna fire on my infantry. Oh, I didn't realize he had that covered. Yikes, that's not good. Um, no, he fires on my medium tank, which was actually the smarter move. Uh, as his full tank attack my medium, just his small day attack my medium, and moves his sub back because he wants to take revenge. Okay. Uh, like I said in the other mission, capture his, so he has to capture extra. Fire away. Once you get rid of alright, we got rid of his battleship. That was the biggest threat. He didn't do too much damage, thank goodness. But there are cases where he can go a little bit overboard with that. Alright, um. Alright, let's move here. Okay, now you wanna. Oh gosh, really? I did that? Okay. destroy his submarine well not his submarine, his lander like if you destroy both of his landers he has no way to get these and these are yours for good so you wanna see what you can do about keeping them move this guy out of the way move this tank off and we will end our turn this is power I'm a tough old sea doll tsunami this does one damage to every unit you have, and I believe also it has all the... I don't know if this happens in this one or the next one, but it also has all of your uh, fuel. Ah, crap. I didn't realize this sub was that close. Oh, man. That sucks. Really bad. And it's raining on top of that. Oh, wonderful. 
Um. Okay, it doesn't do it till the next one because that guy's on 95 fuel. All right, hyper repair. This is why I liked using Andy while fighting Drake. Once he uses his power, Andy's power becomes a lot more helpful. It just heals back. It basically heals one to everybody rather than healing two. Because it recovers the damage he did with his power and heals an extra. Alright. That is one of the most trolliest things ever. Alright, we are going to fire away. Dealing massive points of damage. Alright, we will continue to capture. And when I will build a recon to deal with infantry. Um, he fires, I fire back. I don't know if I can defeat his other... I don't know if I can or not. Day 6. Cool. Can I defeat his lander? Yes I can. I'm going to do that. To secure those cities. Alright, cool. We secured the cities. Now we are going to destroy his submarine. We get... Uh, it's decently close. Uh, there are no ports, so you don't need to worry about him building any more naval units. Which would be a nightmare. Um, actually move this guy back. Move this guy forward. And... Thought I was gonna sneeze. <laughs> Green Earth rocket launchers look pretty cool, you got it. Uh, that's just my thought. Which I think is totally right. Hey. Alright, he needs seven properties, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He needs to actually be in my base to win and that's never gonna happen so I say that and I could terribly lose but I don't think I will okay he captures that one okay he attacks APC which is nice I didn't want him to attack my tank, and he didn't, which is totally cool. He does attack my infantry, though. Okay. He is pushing pretty hard down there, so I'm trying to think of a good way to deal with it. Um, well, I'll go ahead and deal all the damage to his infantry. That would be one thing. See if I can't do some. Nah, I didn't. I kind of figured if I couldn't do any, I wouldn't do it. I was hoping I would do more, but no. I'm going to come in and do 45% on his artillery. What I think is a little bit more important is this thing because it destroys infantry. Like, there is no tomorrow, so... Dealing with that guy is important. Okay. I think that is enough infantry. So build another recon. 
keep capturing. Blow up the sub. Alright. I have complete control over the seas. Uh, yet again, he tsunamis everything. Ugh. And the, the annoying thing about tsunami is that it makes you also anything that you bought or you were trying to repair is immediately damaged, and you have to pay to repair it. If you can't use your power before then, which really sucks. So. Yep. Okay. Um, why not? We just blow up his artillery and be done with it. And I have no way of healing my units, so... That's annoying. Hey, attack me! It's not like he's gonna go anywhere else. He only has 10 fuel. He'll sink after that. Alright. Aw, oh, come on! Really? Didn't do that one damage that I needed. Alright. Um, okay, tank. And it's gone. There we go. Hmm. Goes down to three. Okay. Mm -hmm. Distracts his medium tank, which is nice. Okay. Ah, oh, gosh. And hyper repair. Heal everything. Alright, we're good to go on that. I think it's okay for me to roll out the medium tank. Um Alright, cool, we just wipe out his infantry unit. That's completely cool. Okay, deal some damage. Went down to six, and come in and deal some more. I'm trying to think. It, it there really isn't that much more of commentating on this. It's just trying to push through the rest of his units and capture as you go. Like, I need five properties, so I need to capture uh, these two, these two, and one more, and I win. He needs to capture four. And as I said, that ain't gonna happen. He has to get up in my base to do that. That's why I, I said you want to make sure you have control of the middle island because he can win without going in your base and you want him to have to go in there to deal with it. And doing this right here with your 
submarine's probably the best thing after everything else is dead. It's just distracting the medium tanks. So you have a chance to build up your force to get over there before he sends them. So. Alright. Pull it over there one more time. Deal with the tank. Okay, we blow this guy up. Alright. Want to pull him in and go some pew pew in. We got the pew pew going. Capture. This is not the best commentary I know. I'm trying to. I can't really. I'm trying to concentrate. And it's hard to concentrate while having sinus issues and playing a strategy game. They don't go well together at all. <laughs> Who knew? Um. Okay. I'm just curious. Okay, he can't use his power, so. I didn't want to have to waste three turns doing it. Would have been three turns anyway, though. Uh, he got rid of it with artillery. Nah, that shucks. I was hoping it would be one of the medium tanks, but nope. He did the smart thing. Okay, he got rid of them. And that. Uh. Oh, it's snowing. Oh, just wonderful. It it screws with him as much as it screws with me, but still. That's just not cool. Alright, fire away. Oh, we got two HP left on it. Here we go, pew pew. Defeat that. Alright, let's do some of that. Do that. Do that. Okay, we got that captured. Move in the medium. Move in artillery. Build another medium and then turn. Alright, he sends in the, in the air. Gosh, I'm getting tired. I think this will be the last recording for the night. Okay, day 12. Okay, so we'll go over here. Start capturing. Um, I'm going to do some damage real quick. Like I, I knew that was going to happen, but I was doing that so I can move this guy in and destroy the rest of it. With ease. Alright, um... Move him back so I can move this guy in to deal some major damage to the mech. Those are some of the weirdest mechs I've ever seen, though. It, like I said, Yellow, Yellow Comet has the best looking units of all. I do like the Green Earth's uh, rocket launchers, but look at their tank, the medium tanks. Those are utterly silly looking. But they look pretty. But these guys look pretty cool. APCs pretty much look the same, with little minor differences. Like, the artillery, yet again, looks kind of weird. It, 
I honestly think it's kind of cool. Even it, there's four armies, and each one of them has a different design for each one of their units. And I, uh, to me, that's really cool little design feature. Okay. Um. Okay, fire away. Boom. Okay. Thirty five percent, of course. Uh, Okay, move this guy down here, and we'll end. Oh man, I'm tired. <sighs> uh, can I shoot that with a rocket? No, I can't. 94%. Will I get the 100? Probably not. Yeah, I did. So. Sad, but that happened. Okay, move him in. Have the rocket move here. Have this guy move here. Medium tank come down. Move over. And rocket. Tank. Okay. Yeah, I'm super tired. The fact that he went for my artillery was weird. Okay, 94 once again. Ugh. Missing that six percent to just utterly destroy him. Oh, sad. Very sad. Oh, great! He's gonna do that one damage to everybody. He moves. He moves. He moves in and does tons of damage. And I can't use my power to heal at all. Okay. Do that. Get some Mongo damage in there. Because apparently Mongo is a amount nowadays. Just go ahead and get like your units ready for that. Like for this case, I want to capture that base that's sitting right there because it's easier to get to. Um, you know what? I want to see him have no uh, properties whatsoever. So I'm actually going to try to capture his um, HQ. Boom. Alright. And he can't build anymore, and he doesn't have any units to attack with or capture with. He is dead. Oh.
I didn't know that happened. <laughs> okay, you can either destroy all of his units, or you can capture the necessary bases. I just destroyed all of his units. Okay. A job well done! You beaten me. So, you're Drake? Hell, that'd be me. I wanted to find some answers here, but I've knitted more questions. Uh, I'll be seeing you again, lad. <laughs> you were so close. <laughs> Love that sea fresh sea air. Yeah, my speed sucked on that one. <laughs> 27 freaking days. Uh, oh well. Alright. Sorry about that long episode. Gosh. That took forever. Um, anyway guys, if you actually liked that, <laughs> um, click the like button. If you want to see more of my stuff, click subscribe. And go to my main, hey, go to my channel page. Uh, and you can look up some more stuff I've done. Uh, comment if you have any feedback you want to give me. Uh, just be nice about it. Uh, to me and other people. Otherwise, I will ban you from the comment section. Um, thank you guys for watching. This has been Advance Wars, and I will see you next time.